Hey, what's up, peeps? Today is day four of the new U17. Days going really, really well. These days have been really, really good. It's keeping me on track, which I absolutely love. Sometimes it's tough, but you know, it's keeping me on track, so I absolutely love it. Um, in terms of my nutrition and training today, today is going to be a lot more a lot different from yesterday whereas yesterday was cardio exercise explosive movements today's going to be resistance training using machines and uh, dumbbells going to be doing a total body workout mainly focused on my legs and my arms today and also going to be doing some abs at the end hopefully in terms of nutrition same as yesterday as i said in my other video i like to keep things nice and simple when it comes to nutrition don't want too much things to think about because there is loads to think about if you want to be changing your meals every single day so it's going to be the same as yesterday um and outside of that it's going to be the first day where i go back to training my clients so it's going to you know there's going to be a lot to work on today there's going to be People that have gone too far in terms of putting on weight or too, you know, too out of the flow of training. So, yeah, it's going to be kind of tough, but hey, we're going to get it done like we always do. So, stay tuned. So, these are my meals and my snacks stacked up for the day. The only thing that's missing from here is some Irian water. This is what's going to keep me nice and fueled for the day. Starting up my workout, starting off with cardio, doing some incline walks. I'm uh, not going to do no intervals today, I don't think. I'm just going to keep it to incline walks and then I'm going to get into some resistance training. Hey guys, I want to give you some feedback on this exercise. The feedback I'm going to give you is something that you can use throughout your entire workout anytime you're doing resistance training. Now, even though it looks like I'm doing a perfect movement, this exercise is working my hamstrings by the way, even though it looks like I'm doing a perfect movement, I'm actually not. I'm actually doing something that I see a lot of people making this mistake. And you know, I'm part of it, I make the mistake as well. Here I'm just absolutely not focusing, so I made the mistake. But what it is, is basically, when I was using my left leg, there was a complete lack of control in the eccentric part of the movement, which is when I'm dropping the weight. And you can see, with this right leg, I'm slowly lowering the weight back down. Now this is gonna help keep the muscles under tension throughout the whole movement, which is very, very, very important.
it down my shake. It's been about two hours after training. As you can see here. The protein I have is uh, diametized, ISO 100. Um, I like it, it's nothing special to be honest with you. But I just like it, it does the job. It does the job for me, so I have it. It's a great way of just getting the protein without getting too much extra carbs or fat. It's really low on carbs or fat, that's why I like it the most. So yeah, it's my problem. It's been a great day, a really, really great day. Just got back to training with my clients, let them know that this year is going to be the year where we make some serious, serious changes. I made everybody set their goals. Let me know your goals. Fresh start, set your new goals, whatever they are. And we're going to do whatever it takes, whatever it takes to make sure we get there. Let every single one of my clients know that today. And I really mean that whatever it takes, obviously nothing, you know, illegal or anything. But whatever it takes to get them to their fitness goals is what we're going to be doing. In terms of myself, training was good. I haven't yet sparked that full-on kick of energy yet where, you know, you're just ready to go and you're feeling great and, you know, everything's just like a big joy. It's fun. I'm still enjoying it. Don't get me wrong. But I know when I'm really, really enjoying the training. For some reason, I haven't hit that point yet. I'm, I'm doing what I've got to do and stuff, doing the workouts, getting my reps done. But still, the energy, the spark, the full spark that I know that I have when I'm really, really, really enjoying my training is just not there yet. But I'm sure it will come. This is just the third, fourth day back of getting back into training. So I'm sure, slowly and slowly, it will come. Nutrition, absolutely nice, absolutely brilliant. Keeping everything healthy. To be honest, actually, at the end of today, round about, it got to about 6 o'clock. And I hadn't eaten, I hadn't eaten since, I hadn't eaten for a while. And I, to be honest, in my head I was like, man, I want to, you know, I want to just have some, a little bit of a cheat. I didn't do it, I'd stuck to my discipline, I didn't do it, but that thought just came across my head and it was just floating for a good 10 minutes. Maybe we should just make some nice, you know pasta with this or that but i did not give in your boy stayed strong so yeah um managed to stay on track came back home had my nice chicken salad beetroot which actually tasted really really good um i recently started using this nando sauce don't 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 you know it's, it's nando sauce as i said in before i i love to have my sauces i don't hold back on sauces but i just do not overdo it so yeah i had my nando sauce it was nice um it added like a little bit of a, a chili a kind of a, it added volume it added heat to the meal which sometimes you know just does the job so yeah had that and um that's it that's that's it for now i'm about to go bed after i make this video and yeah that will be me so guys Stay tuned. Tomorrow will be another awesome day. I'll see you soon.